Hey there. This is some abs you can do. Okay, when I start out with my abs, I like to do a, a pelvic tilt. So, um, hands laced behind your head, feet flat on the floor, and I'm just going to um, rock my pelvis back and forth, and all I'm doing is tilting my pelvis from an anterior tilt, which was a little space underneath your back, to a posterior tilt with, where there's no space underneath your back and the floor, right, between your back and the floor. So there's space, no space. Anterior tilt, posterior tilt. So I start out the uh, abs doing this, back and forth. You can even go side to side and uh, a circular motion like a clock. <clears throat> this is good to get in tune with your, with your pelvis and uh, kind of loosen it up. There's not many times during the day in our life that we can actually do this, um, but it's a, it's a function that we should all have. Right? Being able to move your pelvis freely um, with, with strength, not just um, so th it's not a, an issue of flexibility, it's a, the issue of um, being able to access uh, this movement pattern. Okay? Um, so now you're going to uh, let your back settle into a uh, natural anterior tilt. You got a little space in your back, you're not totally. You don't have your tail tucked under you, okay? So you're going to a little tilt, and you're going to bring your ribs right into your hips. So all I'm doing is moving my rib cage towards my hips and pushing my ribs, uh, my, the back of my ribs, onto the floor. Then I'll lift my legs up, I'll crunch and hold, lift the legs up, and then redo it. So I'm leaving my ribs down on the floor, but I'm still pulling myself up using my ribs. I'm not trying to just yank on my neck. I'm using my ribs uh, as like a teeter-totter to pull my head and shoulders up. And then the next version is your legs straight up. All right. Next one would be here. Um, crunch and hold as high as you can, still with that interior tilt in your back. You can go down and up with your legs. One leg at a time, and you can do both. Keeping those abs in into your body. Don't let your stomach cooch out. The Pilates pump is here. <clears throat> pump your arms like there's two balloons underneath your arms. <clears throat> while you drop your legs about two inches every 10 pumps. Keep crunching up. Don't um, allow yourself to roll back. You can go all the way down to um, where your legs are a couple of inches off the floor, you know, five to six inches off the floor. Crisscross abs, <clears throat> crunch, lift. You can start with just, just a rotation back and forth this way, and then you can add the, the leg. Crisscross abs. <clears throat> Swimming. So you can crunch up, hold the swim, and then as you re reach your arms back behind you, crunch even higher, and swim your arms back around this way. Crunch even higher, crunch yourself higher as you lift your arms up, reach around, add your legs. Next one um, is a uh, V-up, different uh, versions of a V-up. Opposite arm, opposite leg. <clears throat> one leg stays down as you come up and touch one side. And then the two, both arms, both legs, V up. Teaser V up. This is a teaser. Do that one more time. After you do a um, bunch of those, it's a, a lot of hip flexing. Open up your hips. Again, you can come halfway down, just using your butt to open up your hips, not your low back. You can also do this one leg at a time to really work on your legs, your hips uh, independently. <clears throat> halfway down, back up. I'm working on using my butt to open up my hip, pressing through my heel. 
planking. Um, start thinking uh, this relationship between your ribs and your hips and keeping them connected as you plank. Here. You can do taps out to the side. Come up to a high plank. Lift one side up, one arm, one leg. Opposite arm, opposite leg lift. I like to end the, uh, a series of planks with a um, child's pose and a cat-cow cat stretch. <clears throat> Side planking. <clears throat> so I go uh, start from easier to make it a little more difficult. Bottom leg bent, top leg straight. You want to get in this nice straight plank. Halfway down, back up. <clears throat> Straighten both legs out. Halfway down, back up. Then you can add a rotation. Rotate down, back up, stay in this nice plank. Rotate down, back up. All right, there's some abs for you. Enjoy it. See you next time.